And Lagos State Governor Babajide Sonwalu has declared that his administration will continue to provide massive infrastructure renewal, improve the quality of life of the people and drive massive socioeconomic growth through infrastructure upgrade and renewal. Governor Sanwolu gave his, this assurance while speaking at the commissioning of the Ogudu Alakbere Link Road and Prince Adesa Gia Joseph Street in Lagos, disclosed that his administration has nothing that it has painstakingly reworked the state's transportation master plan, putting in place the required infrastructure that will bedrock and drive the implementation of laudable initiatives in the sector for optimal benefit of Lagosians. The governor assured that his government will continue to offer respite and succor to road users in the state by putting in place an enduring framework for the delivery of road infrastructure as well as for the provision of supporting drainage infrastructure to sustain these roads. Even as we end our first tenure and we start a second tenure of a greater Lagos that it's on course and we will not stop at anything until when we reassure yourselves and we assure ourselves too that we're able to achieve all of the things and everything that we've said is that we want to bring about better economic growth and development within our communities we want to ensure that people live in a safe and secure environment we want to ensure that people have access to good health to good schools and have access to quality road infrastructure Sangwalu also described the Ogudu community in Koshafel local government area as a strategic settlement with a fast-growing population with a huge need for infrastructural renewal and a development which prompted his administration to embark upon the construction of a reinforced concrete deck on pile culvert to address the challenge of flooding. We're happy that we can continue to see that when we put ourselves together and we say we want purposeful and meaningful development, it can happen. You have listened to clear testimonial from the residents and from the citizens that are in this neighborhood that what we have done is a short but very important and strategic road because it has a link component and it's a road that is supposed to connect two communities you know, within the same local government and opens up you know, connectivity reduces journey time and give our citizens a better experience on the road. Before the project inception and intervention, this road, the existing roads were without drainage. The pictures in the pamphlet actually speaks to the condition that you have on the roadway. It was entirely swampy and bad. There was no drainage and there was a disconnect and it was an existing wetland. Plus, the immediate environment was subject to flooding with consequent negative impact on transportation given the low line and swampy nature of the area. The delivery of both the fire and 45 meters long with a link bridge with an average width of 14.6 meters and a 22 meter length bridge as well as a 600 meter long 7.4 meter width Prince Adjose Road would serve as a good alternative to congest areas around the Ogudodota link axis and the underpass. This will in turn help reducing travel time in the axis and manner as lost in traffic. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.